anything that have stopped you from being a prayer warrior while you are this young i assure you if you don't master prayer now you will never pray yes when you get that employment in hello believers i am sure that the video you are about to watch is going to bless you because in the video you are about to see apostle arome or sign talks about the power prayer brings to a believer every believer needs power and that power can only come from the place of prayer if you can sit down and listen to this audio trust me your prayer life is going to shift to the next level and you're going to acquire the power to move into your next level so therefore sit back and get blessed that bank and you are balancing accounts from morning till 7 p.m you will backslide because you didn't develop anything upon which you'll be able to build the everyday the edifice and the superstructure of your life and your destiny i worked in the oil industry for 16 years i worked offshore many times i learned how to fast on the job because i used to fast on campus one of my friends was the fasting machine he does 21 days dry fasting on campus so he came to me and said god did not create so much power in my life if not i would have found it that's him. That's it. That much. He said, he, he, he didn't give me power. If not, I would have found it. But he gave you power. Talk, re, re, referring to me. He said, go and find it. The guy could fast. He could fast. Hey. He said, go and find it. So he's the one that insisted that I begin to fast. The first three days dry fasting, I did. The things I saw, I didn't understand it. I went back to him, I said, this is strange. What kind of strange? He said, ah, fast again. Until it became a lifestyle. Yes. Yes. Then I started fasting 100 days, 200 days, 264 days. Yes, because men ought always to pray. Some of you, you will not be able to break that yoke of fornication on your life until you are determined to go like 80 days. The day the thing breaks, you will know. Oh, you are just sitting down and expecting good things to happen to you. I came to tell you that Satan is alive. Hmm. So yeah, so you are expecting good things. That is, when I finish, I'll go here. They'll give me a car. I'll be honing in the market. Wake up. <laughs> oh, man, not always to pray. My, my friend taught me fasting and prayer. I started fasting. started fasting. For that whole year, I, God didn't speak. The next year, I continued. I continued. And while I was writing my last paper on campus, he came. I know you will not believe. Huh? Okay. Look at that. It's cancer. <laughs> yes, a time came I knew him. And the moment I knew him, prayer became easy. Fasting became easy. Because I was doing praying and fasting on his energy, on his strength. Yeah, I will be spending his energy to do it. So it, it wasn't a challenge anymore. Oh, I entered into a new economy. Sin can be in the entire place, but it won't touch me. 
because I went deeper. I went deep. I went deep. So the products that you are advertising, I, I didn't see it. I'm seeing something else. And when Satan sees that you refuse to dwell in the city of North, he makes you a target because he knows that you can open the eyes of every occupant of that land and lead them out of that city. He knows that. He will hunt you. And the cure for Satan is go deeper in God. So we continue going deep. Yeah. Oh, I can tell you stories. I've seen demons, territorial spirits, principalities. I've seen them. I've seen them. If I tell you some things, you'll be afraid. The attacks, the darkness that fell upon me. And you know where light came from? Light didn't come from heaven. Light came from inside of my spirit. Inside. Before you know it, it has attacked my wife. Before you know it, it has attacked my son. I went deeper. So the cure is go deeper. For in those days, men began to call upon the name of the Lord. The question is, when will you begin your own? People are big. People, they began in the days of Seth. When will you begin? Your prayer adventure. I can tell you stories. I can show you places, spots where Jesus spoke to me audibly. If I take you to the north in Nigeria. Places where angels appear to me. I can take say, this, this. And they didn't come and disappear. They were there for three hours. Oh. Jesus has appeared to me five times, five times, five times. I'm not talking about a vision, no, the one you see in the spirit, no. Go deeper. Please help me tell your neighbor, go what? Deeper. When you go deeper, you will not need to ask for power. Like this evening, I didn't ask for power. No. I just say, what are you saying today? Then the scripture came. Let us make man. That was all. So I knew the other ones. As long as I have that scripture, I can hear the thing. I don't need to ask, will you come? Will, no, no. And some days the anointing can be so strong that even the dead can be brought back to life. We were called because this is Africa's time of focus. Sons and the daughters of Africa will set the stage for the glory of God. And so each and every one of us will need to take our journey from that city of darkness. And like Abraham, we will navigate through spiritual pathways in search of our inheritance. The days of hard measures and talk and impurity are over. God has sent an alarm for the Puritans and the Nazarites. Men whose garments are not stained to align with him because he wants to do damage to the kingdom of darkness in the territory. Will you line up with God or you continue in that strange city? Will you line up with Jehovah or you continue in that strange place? upon the name of the Lord. If you lived in the days of Cain, on which side will you be? I chose my side long ago. I will stand with the men and the women of prayer and will keep praying until God will break through the heavens and I 
answered us. Oh, we will not be weary. We will not faint. We will keep praying, calling upon the name of the Lord until He comes. The altars of darkness in your family will suddenly wither. The liabilities of causes will be broken. The light will shine out of darkness.
I'm sure you were greatly blessed by the video you have just watched. If you were, do well to like, to subscribe, and most importantly, share to that person that you think needs to see this video. That is part of the work of ministry, you know. So tell somebody to tell somebody to tell that person about what is going on here by sharing the link to them. We love you.